I feel like I need to do the dance because I'm here with you. I've been waiting to do this. Hey, how you, how you feel? <laughs> Good. Um, I'm so happy to sit down with you um, and chat about this. First of all, um, you know, the big finale airs tonight. Everyone's really excited about that. How do you yeah. feel? Do you watch? Have you been watching all season? I have. And what do you think when you watch yourself on the show? Like, how have you been feeling? Uh, some moments, very emotional, mm -hmm. um, analytical. Yeah. But uh, it's interesting because every episode is good. has been different and uh, it's been fun. Okay. I see myself on TV just all over the place. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's crazy, right? Yeah. It's a bit surreal. It is. It's like, is that me? Yeah. I said that? Like, wow, but it's been great. What has it been like in your life, like walking down the street? I'm sure people are like, oh my God, it's here oh. from The Bachelorette. It's been different. Yeah. You, you know, people are fans of the show. And we're taking pictures. And, yeah. Getting a lot of selfies. Mm -hmm. and, you know, love. It's, it's been great. So the night that you went to after the final rose and you met Rachel, yeah. which we thought was for the very first time, yeah. wasn't actually the first time you met Rachel. Oh, it's the second time. That is crazy. It's crazy. Right? So when did you meet her before? So the week prior to that Monday, mm -hmm. AFR, uh, I was training a client at 10 a.m. I remember it like yesterday because that week was my birthday. My birthday is March 9th, so whatever that Monday was. I go in the gym and she's in there training with the training. I'm like, what? I call, I call my friend Michael. And did you know you were on the show at this point already? I knew I was so on the show. So you knew you were cast? Right. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And so I'm like, I'm just like, go from the show. I'm like, is that her? You know, she wears the, like, the bandana. Like, I'm like, yeah. oh, okay. Looking all cute. I walk over out. there and I literally just jump. Like, oh, wow, that's her. I walk in, I freak out, call my friend Michael. She said, oh. He said, you have to say something. So she was, <laughs> she was, she trained outside for most of her workout. Yeah. And... When she came in, I said, Rachel, you working hard. She said, I'm trying. I said, but you're doing good. And I said, but I'll see you soon. She was like, so then, I'll see you soon. She was like, got it. She left. So she knew, basically. She either thought that she like, didn't you were going to be stalking did. her or right. you were going to be on the show. <laughs> right, absolutely. absolutely. One or the other, one yeah. or the other. That is so, so at that point, you must have felt like, okay, this is kind of like fate. That I'm gonna yeah, like, this girl, right? Happen? Like, did they set this up? Yeah. I was really thrown off. I didn't know, but it was oh my great. gosh! Can you imagine if you guys end up together tonight, watching the finale? It's a miracle season. What? It's a miracle season. And then if you met each other like that, it would no. like seriously be like a fairy tale it's story. Fairy tale. I kind of hope that that happens. I would, yeah. all right, it's so funny. At the beginning of the season, I you know I blog about the show on this blog every single week. I was positive it was you. I was like, right. Eric is the one, I know it, that chemistry, it's so good. Then I went back and forth, yes, that dance, you guys used to, you didn't only had chemistry, you had rhythm together, you had that nice rhythm together, and yeah, and then I kind of was like, okay, wait, it might be Peter, because her and Peter were getting really close. I never really thought it was Brian, kind of until the end, that I was like, oh my gosh, it might be Brian, yeah. and now I'm just totally confused, and I don't know which one of you it is. You have that's us all stumped. That's Give that's us a hint. That's a great place to be in. <laughs> Very confused. What if I ask you a question like, um... Well, how does Rachel take her coffee in the morning? Ooh, oh, she takes it nice and slow. <laughs> <laughs> Rachel! Because <laughs> if you were engaged to her, you might know that information right now. Yeah. You guys hear a little baby in the Less background. Is that's more. Right. Less is more. Okay, all right. We'll have to wait until tonight. tonight. Do you ever, when you watch, are you ever, ever like cringeworthy moments for you? Like, are you ever like, oh, I can't believe I said that? Like, looking back on the season, is there anything you would have done differently? Oh. Uh, Yes and no. I say no because it allowed me to look at myself from a constructive criticism perspective right. and say, because if everything was perfect, then what would I have to do, right? Yeah. So I think some moments I wish I would have spoke different or would look different, but yeah. it didn't happen. Yeah. So I think it was, the way I was presented was perfect. Okay, good. For like, me to give myself the feedback that I need and say, oh, okay. Now I see yeah. what I I think as a viewer, and yeah. like even like just a little bit that I've gotten to know you, you know, we had um, hung out for a little bit before we started filming this, um, I feel like I know so much more about you than what I learned on the show, uh -huh. not only from the little bit I've got to talk to you, but also what I've read about you. I kind of, yeah. I, I, I internet stopped him oh. before we came here, yeah. um, and I learned that you were in two books, yeah. incredible, you're a motivational speaker, uh -huh. you know, you do the personal training. Right. You're very tall, by the way. Am I? You're taller than I thought. Really? And you came in, I was like, all right, he's, he's such a nice tall guy. Oh, okay. If you are single after this, I have a few girlfriends I might have in there with you. <laughs> but we don't know. We'll find out tonight. Where would you be watching the finale, by the way? Where are you watching it? That's a great question. You don't know yet? I don't know. You have to, you have to watch and see. Maybe with Rachel? 
Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Trying to get it out of him, guys. I was trying. He's not budging. <laughs> She's good. She's, She's good. not budging. Um, I guess going in, was she what you expected? Because I've met Rachel a couple times, and I think, I mean... I mean, obviously, if you guys are together, you think she's lovely. I think she's so lovely and smart. Was yes. she everything you expected? Everything and then some. Oh, okay. She's the truth. She's the total package. She's all that. Yeah. And a bag of chips. Oh. Shouts out to Rachel. Okay, <laughs> all right. Is she's that... amazing. She's amazing. Inside out. She's, she's, she comes from a great family, great foundation. Mm -hmm. She's, she's everything. She's the total package. Okay, so it's you. Brian and Peter left. So I have better know, what are your thoughts first? Let's talk about Peter. Peter. Uh, Peter's a great guy. Okay. He's very reserved. All right. He doesn't open up easily. He's okay. a Pisces as well. I'm a Pisces, so I get him. He's very emotional at times. All right. So you guys are similar emotional. in the sense that you kind of have walls up a little oh, bit. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. All right. Yeah. He's just not as open as I am, talking uh -huh. about his feelings and emotions, and he's more observant, he's laid back. Yeah. And, uh, and there's questions of whether cool or not guy. he's ready. He seems like a cool guy, but whether yeah. he's ready to commit. Right. In your personal opinion, is he ready to commit? I don't think so. Um, I don't think so. And do you think it's maybe? Do you think it's because he's not ready? I just think it's not the right time for him right now, for whatever reason. All right. From talking to him and being with him, it just doesn't seem like the timing is not right for him right now yeah. to fully commit. Maybe um, somewhat, but not all the way. Not all the way. What about Brian? Brian seems like he's ready to commit. Yeah, Brian's like this. He's what is a straight shooter. Like, I'm <laughs> okay. coming in now. Let's go. <laughs> no, but Brian, we built a strong bond, you know, on the show. Um, but he seems like he knows what he wants. And he's older. So were you yeah. close with Brian? Yeah, I was. Oh, really? Yeah, we were close. Who are you closest with in the house? Uh, so Matt being number one. Mm -hmm. So when I had my drama in the house, Matt talked me into a different perspective mm -hmm. to keep me sane. Adam. Mm -hmm. AG, uh, Adam Jr. Ladal, um, great guy. We connected <laughs> Adam like, Jr. and you got along yeah, real well. On business and just life, um, mm -hmm. great person. Um, and Brian, right. we room together in a lot of hotels and it's just the, you know conversation. Is there anything you can think of that people would be surprised to learn about the season, like something that went on behind the scenes that we don't know about that maybe would surprise us, whether um, it's serious or funny? I fell off the golf cart. I don't know if they've seen that. <laughs> I banged my ankle up, almost dislocated my shoulder. What? But I did get an MVP of the basketball game. Okay, well, good. Yeah, yeah. So, and, uh, but what about what with the dynamic between oh. the guys? Oh, the, between the guys. Like, good or bad? Either or. So, Peter, Brian, and then. They don't like each other? It wasn't that they didn't like each other. They didn't, they didn't see eye to eye. Okay. I feel like they were like their competition like throughout the season. We kind of see that like, Brian and Peter have a conversation and Peter says to Brian, I don't want to be talking to you right now. Yeah. So that was like the only real glimpse at least I saw of them not getting along, but you saw more of that behind the yeah. scenes. Brian was more cool about it, Peter was like, <laughs> So interesting. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm dying to know more. Maybe we'll see more behind the scenes of that, I don't know. Before you go, I cannot let you go um, without giving me some, us, all of us Allie Loves readers, some sort of hint of what we're going to see tonight. Hmm. It's a miracle season. <laughs> it's meant to be, will be. The journey continues. And oh, baby, it's real. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take that. that we can't wait. Eric. If we, I, I thank you so much for sitting down with me. Thank I hope that me. you know you find love in your life, whether it's with Rachel or someone else. Um, but it's been such a pleasure getting to know you, and we, I wish you the best. Cheers. So cheers. <laughs>